Hey Indianapolis Motor Speedway fans, Doug Bowles with you here on another episode of Behind the Bricks. Not exactly at the racetrack today, but I am definitely on property that belongs to the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. I'm right in the middle of our solar farm. Some of you may have heard of it. Some of you can actually see it from your grandstand seat if it's high enough up. It looks like a lake way off in the distance behind the racetrack on the east side. Of the, of the golf course. You know, this is a piece of property. Basically, we have 68 acres of property here that for a long period of time, we didn't really know exactly what to do with. We're right in the middle of a neighborhood, or right at a street called 21st and Louette. And in 2013, we had an opportunity with some partners to actually decide to develop this into a solar farm. And in 2014, we cut the ribbon on it. So what you're looking at right here is to how we've used basically 68 acres. What you've got is 40 plus acres of it that's actually solar farms. If you took all these panels off and laid them on the ground, it'd be about 21 and a half acres of solar farms. It's really enough to cover every inch of asphalt on the oval for two and a half times around with these 48 inch by 72 inch panels. There's 40,000 of these panels, a little under 40,000 of these panels here. Basically what happens the sun is captured through these panels. These panels then go to an inverter, which then goes to the transformer that's all here on property. And then those transformers take that energy and deliver it. It's all over Indianapolis. It doesn't go directly back to the Speedway, but powering things all over the Indianapolis. We, deli we deliver about nine megawatts of power here. It's enough to do about a thousand homes. Each one of these panels is about 230 watts. So this panel could, uh, could power your television, your computer, your small appliance at home. But like I said, there's a little under 40,000 of these panels here. If you were following the Speedway this year, you also noticed that we were accredited by the Council for Responsible Sport. And that's because we started to focus a little bit on sustainability. But one of the things that really helped us get that accreditation was this solar farm right here. It is the largest solar farm on a sporting complex in the world currently. There are some folks that are gonna build some that are a little bit bigger, but we've been doing this for almost 10 years, so a little ahead of our time. Something that a lot of people don't know we have here at the Speedway, it's a little off the beaten path. So we felt the best way to use it, let's turn it into this 68 acres of solar panels and solar field that's delivering power back to the grid, especially on a day like today when we're getting all this sunshine. Look forward to seeing you again on the next episode of Behind the Bricks about the Indianapolis Motor Speedway.